So you want to draw poses from imagination but suck at anatomy. Here's my anatomy course, part two. Now to understand the torso and the abdomen, I'll be using the bean model. The ribcage and pelvis can be simplified into two circles with the pelvis being a little bit shorter and wider depending on the body proportions. Now the torso also includes skin and guts in between. Notice how it bends and twists. Remember to still look for the line of action. Here I'm looking for the line of action in the spine. When the body twists and turns, different plane changes can occur. Look for lines that signal plane changes such as along the chest and spine. Also keep in mind that when the body compresses on one side, it will stretch on the other side. The more the circles overlap, the more foreshortening there is. You can use the bean model as a foundation for drawing your character's bodies as this establishes basic proportions and is also a solid base point for other body parts. 